one-time allies now facing off in battle. Wednesday brought a third straight day of clashes in southern Yemen between Saudi-backed government troops and a separatist group backed by the United Arab Emirates, known as the Southern Transitional Council. The two sides are currently fighting for control of the city of Zinjibar, capital of the southern province of Abiyan. Until recently, they were united in the fight against Houthi rebels based in northern Yemen, who captured the capital Sana'a in 2014. But in April, the Southern Transitional Council declared self-rule over the key port city and interim government seat of Aden in a bid to restore a southern Yemeni nation that had been separate from the north from 1967 until 1990. Yemen's official government accuses the separatists of destabilizing the situation and refusing to de-escalate. It's urged the council to stick to a power-sharing deal between the two sides brokered by the Saudis in November. The increasingly complex five-year civil war has already killed more than 100,000 fighters and civilians. It's also destroyed Yemen's health care system and left its population weakened by malnutrition. With some 70 known coronavirus cases in the south, the World Health Organization says it now fears Yemen is likely in the midst of unchecked transmission, warning that the disease could prove especially devastating there.